I'm Brian Altano and this is IGN Now. Netflix has announced that the streaming platform will be producing a live action film based on the hit video game, Bioshock. In a tweet, the streamer said it will be partnering with 2K and Take-Two on a live action adaptation of Ken Levine's popular immersive sim set in an underwater city that was meant to house the greatest minds on Earth before it all went to hell. You remember the game. The Hollywood Reporter says no writer or filmmaker is currently attached to the project, although plans for this movie have been in the works for almost a year. Bioshock was released in 2007, that's the video game you know, as a spiritual successor to System Shock, set in a fictional underwater city called Rapture. Players were mysteriously drawn to its depths only to uncover the shocking history of how a city meant to serve as a safe haven for the rich and powerful became an aquatic hell stalked by terrifying diving suited giants called Big Daddies. Considered one of the greatest games of its decade, Bioshock spawned two sequels, Bioshock 2 and Bioshock Infinite. A new Bioshock game is currently in development without creator Ken Levine at a brand new studio called Cloud Chamber. In a statement, Take-Two CEO Strauss Zelnick says, Netflix is among the best and most forward-thinking storytellers in all of entertainment today. We are thrilled that they share our vision and commitment to the Bioshock franchise, which is beloved by millions of fans around the world. Zelnick added, 2K's Cloud Chamber Chamber Studio is deep in active development on the next iteration of the Bioshock series, and coupled with our partnership with Netflix, we remain highly confident that Bioshock will continue to captivate and engage audiences like never before. So yeah, to recap, it looks like we're getting a Netflix Bioshock movie based on the original game, as well as a brand new Bioshock game from 2K's Cloud Chamber. Also worth mentioning that Bioshock series creator Ken Levine started his own studio called Ghost Story Games back in 2017, although that studio has yet to release a single game of their own, with rumors recently circulating that the game and the studio are facing significant problems. Bioshock has long been targeted for a Hollywood adaptation, by the way. Soon after the launch of the first game, Pirates of the Caribbean and The Ring director Gore Verbinski was attached to a live action movie version of the original Bioshock script. According to THR, the director's planned budget and an R rating put the project on indefinite hold until those plans were eventually shelved. Boo! I really wanted a Gore Verbinski Bioshock movie that was like super gory and violent. It's, it's not just his name. Like seriously, go watch The Ring. That movie rules. As R-rated blockbusters have become more prevalent and Netflix is keen on building a stable of known franchises, these issues don't really seem to be a roadblock. Like getting a bunch of people in a theater to watch an R-rated movie, you know, it's, it's tough to do. A lot of movies can pull it off, but Netflix, doesn't matter, go for it, right? So what do you think, those of you watching at home, do you want the Bioshock movie to really lean into the gore and horror that was present in the original game? Or do you want them to take more of like a noir mystery thriller approach here? Either way could work, I want the gory stuff. Let me know in the comments below and for all things Bioshock, Netflix, video game movies in general, stick with IGN, you miserable pile of secrets.